G'day guys, I've just arrived down in uh, Fingal Beach. It's a beautiful day, there's hardly any breeze out there, so it's a perfect day to drone fish. Uh, meeting up with a mate, Sean from GC Drone Reviews, you can check him out on Facebook. And today he's gonna be piloting the, the Swell Pro. So we're gonna put it to the test and drop a bait out there off the rocks, hopefully pick up a tailor or whatever's uh, biting on the day. So uh, we've got the big rods, 13 footer, gang hooks, pillies all ready to go. Rightio guys, the, uh, the Swell Pro's out the box. First thing um, to put the blades on. So you need to match the blades up with what it says on the side here. So you've either got CW or CCW. So we just need to, to match them up. One goes clockwise, the other goes anti-clockwise. So all you do is just push it in and turn it and that locks in. On the other guy, you look for CCW, so you marry them up here as well. So you've got CCW right there. Rightio, next thing is um, we're gonna put the battery in. These are fully charged, I charged them overnight. So just use these elements here. They marry up with the elements on the bottom of the drone. So we just whack it straight in and then give it an extra push just to make sure it's in. Whack the lid on, clip it down and to secure it, just turn it around like that. So that's uh, locked in there nice and safe and it's sealed. Right out, the next thing is uh, we put your remote on so that's pretty easy. Just hold it on there, um, she's all done and she's on. Next step is we put the drone on. So what we're doing is we're linking the drone with the remote so they talk to each other. To get your drone on, all you need to do is press once and then hold for three seconds. So there you go, that drone's on. Um, you get the indication from that noise, a couple of beeps, and also the light flashing on the top. So the next thing you've got to do is um, get your app going. So if you've got a, uh, a Swell Pro drone app, which you all should have, then we can go into calibration um, for your drone. And if, you do, if you've moved from one place to the other more than about 100K, you should always calibrate it. All you need to do, just open her up and then uh, and whack your phone in. Obviously, a lot of phones have uh, buttons on the side, so just be aware of that because you could be uh, calling your mum or someone from the other side of the world if it's, uh, if it's got a mind of its own. So just whack your phone in like that, just lock it in. So that can be used as your, um, your view screen as well, your viewfinder. So we've got, a, um, we've got the app on here. So we just hit the app, login device, um, use your Bluetooth and your, uh, your Wi-Fi as well. So when you hit your Wi-Fi, It'll actually uh, look for the look for the app, and you'll see it's uh, SWB. It's really hard to see, but it's SWB. It'll be up in your Wi-Fi, and, and that just connects everything together, so everything's reading your phone. So next step is is to check for calibration. Um, so on my phone, we've got three dots in the top right-hand corner. I'm just going to hit those, and then. You've got a function called compass calibration. So we're gonna hit that and hit confirm. And then it says rotate aircraft horizontally. So I'll show you how to do that. So quick calibration, we just rotate it clockwise until you get your light turning green underneath. So the next step is uh, we need to calibrate it vertically. Yep. So that's been calibrated and we're getting closer to dropping a bait off. 
I'll just show you the setup that I've got. It's really, really simple. I've got the business end, just a bit of a trace line, couple of gangs. We're going to whack on a pilchard. Um, they, they're telling me there's not many fish out there today, but the main function of this video is to show you how to use the payload. Then what I've got off of here, if you have a close look at that, I've got a little bit of light line hanging off, and, and that light line is going to be the line that hangs off the end of the, uh, the payload. So I just basically clip that on. I'll just show you guys now. So all I need to do is hold my finger on the button that says payload. Hold it down, disengages, and then engages it. So let's have a close look now what it's actually doing. So I've got my swivel, finger on the payload, whack that in. There you go. That's all set, ready to go. And then when we hit it, if we see a fish or you just want to drop your bait, press the button again disengages all right so we're just going to disengage the payload and engage it right she's all in whack the drone on a flat surface and then just uh, drop her down everything low so the drone goes up first and then we're going to carefully uh, aim it out there, probably go a good couple of hundred metres out. And um, keep your finger on the spool just to sort of feather it so nothing goes wrong. I mean, these are waterproof anyway, so if something goes wrong, she'll go in. But we'll be able to get her back up and, and pull her back. So if we get a fish, it's just a bonus, but we'll see what happens. We got uh, like 450 metres of line, so you should be good to go out a fair way, mate. Yeah, slow it down. Do you want to drop it back there? Yeah, release it. Is that dropped? Just uh, winding in the slack. She's probably uh, 250 metres out, so back behind the breakers. Fish is a bonus, but you can see how easy it is to drop that bait. And he's in a bit close. I might catch a boat. Oh no, I've caught a boat. I've caught a boat. Hang on. You got a fish. Hang on. Have I got a You got a fish? No, nah, I've got a boat. I've caught a boat. There you go. That's how you use the uh, Swell Pro drone. We got a boat, be about half a ton. Pulled some line, pulled some drag. For this Taz line, I'll tell you what, it stands up. Hope that guys is gonna help you out on how to uh, drone fish and get your baits out there. My day's done and maybe so is theirs.
because we can uh, show you how to catch boats. Yeah. Well, there you go, guys. All done and dusted. Didn't hook a fish, but uh, I think I hooked a cruise craft. She took off, pulled some string. The Taz line held up and the Swell Pro did its job. So if you guys uh, want to get your hands on a Swell Pro, it's all waterproof with a bait release. All you do is jump on their site, Swell Pro. I'll put the, their link in the uh, description for you. Thanks anyway, guys. Feel free to comment and sub to Coast Fish TV and we'll see you next time.